Hello guys and today I'm going to have some 14 day out of date Chisora star pork sausages okay now these look strange I've never had them before and I put them I bought them on the day they're about to expire they were 75% off because they're about to expire the same day and <coughs> put them in the fridge and sort of have forgotten about them all been busy eating other things and they're dated the 3rd of January and is currently the 17th of January 2023 very early in the morning <coughs> there was a BBC news article with the headline Australian Open bans Russian and Belarusian flags from tournament I couldn't have known that um, 14 days ago there's also a new story by the BBC which says Met of Chief says 800 officers investigated for abuse I couldn't possibly have known that. Um, I've given a more um, graphic title when you actually click on it, to be honest. Um, so, but and there's also a story about um, it says dozens indicted in Brazil over. Congress riot. I'll see if they change the title on that as well. Yep, Brazil Congress. Dozens indicted over eight of a January riot. I couldn't have possibly known about that um, on the 14th. I'm sorry, on the 3rd. So now, what I'm going to do is I'm now going to cook them. I'm going to show you me briefly putting these under the grill. And I also have some out of date. Um, um, rice, this was actually, I paid full price for this, this was actually bought expensively during the Covid times and I kept it safe. Um, it's actually dated November 2021, you can see that, November 2021, but this is like expensive rice, It's normally I wouldn't get rice, it's good normally, especially as I'm on a budget, but during Covid, <coughs> There was a lot of <coughs> people stocking up. You couldn't buy rice. You couldn't buy lots of things. And people just had to go out and buy the expensive brands or you got nothing. And I bought this. And then later, a few days later, I managed to find some cheaper rice. So I used that. And I saved this. And I saved this for like better things like um, exotic stuff. And I consider this to be somewhat exotic. Right? Because it's some sort of strange... Um, Pork. It's got, it says it's got dried red peppers in it, um, smoked paprika, um, garlic powder, dried red bell pepper, dried oregano, paprika extract. It's got a lot of strange stuff in this that you would not get in a normal sausage, not a normal British sausage anyway. It might be normal in, I don't know. some other European country and it says succulent British farm assured pork sausage is perfectly seasoned with a blend of roasted red peppers and paprika I said this is not the sort of thing you'd expect in Britain normally okay so this might be a more European type thing is it on the back? It says coarse pork sausage blended with diced red pepper and seasoning filled into vegetable based casings. So there you go. It's got some instructions on the grill, oven, and also a shallow fry. I'm going to put it under the grill and I'm going to put um, the this in some boiling water okay so now i'm going to go downstairs to the cooker because people ask me sometimes to show me me cooking on the cooker for some strange reason so i'm going to cook this on the cooker then i'm going to put it onto a plate and then i'm going to eat it okay guys right so see you soon all the things i'm going to do on the cooker are going to be without commentary because it's quite early in the morning so i'm going to do it without any commentary okay 
but it's fairly obvious what I'm doing, okay? Okay, I've now cooked it, okay? I know it's not it's a spot on this, but 
difficult to see white on white, but I have cooked it now. And now I'm going to eat it, okay? Right, I've never tried these particular types of sausages before. And you try your eyes. The rice, as I said, is perfectly edible. Just so you can see, this is what the sausage looks like inside. There's little bits of red in there. When I was cooking it, some of the red came out. Um, as you would expect, it doesn't taste quite like a normal, um, I taste it, it almost looks like it's tomatoey, but I wouldn't say it's got a tomatoey taste to it. Um, in fact, it could be quite hot, but it isn't. Um, there's a very slight amount of warmth to it, but in terms of, you know, the spiciness, but not very much. Um, or maybe I'm just getting used to it, I don't know. Maybe I'm just more used to spicy food now, I don't know, but... It tastes almost like you've dipped a sausage in some sauce. So even though I haven't had any sauce to this whatsoever, it almost tastes as if I've dipped it in a lot of sauce. Because it's much more juicy and moist than I would expect um, a sausage to be. Obviously because of the things they put into it. I said I only had two of the sausages because I intend to have two a day with rice, okay? Mm. It's very hard to say anything about it because the sausages are really, really, really juicy. I mean really juicy, more than you would expect. And, um... And definitely tastes different, as I said. It's almost like you, it's like they were meatballs, but they're not. It's almost like they're sort of meatballs, but often the meatballs I've had don't have paprika in or, you know, red peppers in, but it's almost like that. They're, they're almost, I'm quite a to similar to a meatball, but look like a sausage. And... Maybe this type of sausage is common on the continent. That's the parts of your um, Europe to you. But, well, in terms of this context. But, um, definitely unusual, I will give it that. Um, it's like almost like you're eating tomato stuff, but it's not tomato. And I was rather concerned because I thought it might be very, very hot and spicy and, you know, one of these things where almost your mouth explodes, but it isn't, so. I'm very surprised and very good. And given that this is two weeks out of date, um, I didn't switch it honestly. Um, you know, very impressive. I wouldn't have known it just without a date, truthfully. And look at it inside, it still looks perfectly okay, so it doesn't look like it's going green or anything like that, so.
I'm pretty much finished now, so... It's currently about 5 o'clock in the morning, so... I just did it because it'd be one of the few times when it was quite downstairs and... I could do this, okay? Um, there you go, guys. I think it was Chisora sausages with rice. Okay? Thanks for watching. Bye!